question here, how smart are your SMART goals? You'll recall going in that those SMART goals are specific, they're measurable, they're achievable, they are relevant to what you're doing, and they are time sensitive, and that's how we're going to set those up to, to go forward. So right now, based on what you know through the research that you've done up front on your sales channel, along with your best guess at how your art will fit into that channel successfully and the vision that you have of your future business and the lifestyle you'll be leading when you've reached your goals, right now you have a logical starting point to move forward. Then you'll be using systems to measure whether you're reaching milestones uh, along the way and the systems that have been mentioned throughout the courses have been spreadsheets or perhaps a customer relationship management program and some other tools. And with them, you'll be recording and analyzing data. Now, I want to give credit to Daniel, who's done a really superb job of presenting those tools using spreadsheets. He's been looking at the dashboards and uh, the functionality of customer relationship management systems and email marketing programs uh, and so forth. And then if you've looked into the back end, the dashboards there, you've seen pipelines. And those pipelines are uh, the tools that move each sales prospect forward from one stage of the sales cycle to the next. And so through the use of these analytical tools, you're going to be gaining data that are, are going to help you stay organized and make informed decisions going forward. And so I, this type of thinking, analysis, and then action is going to help you stay on track, but also be flexible and make changes that are needed. <music> 